from policemen allegedly attacking um, others to civilians allegedly attacking policemen and armed robbers attacked a uniformed officer at gunpoint on the N1 highway here in Accra, robbing him of 80,000 Ghana cities. The incident happened in broad daylight. According to eyewitnesses, the two men on a motorbike fired warning shots before bolting with the bag containing the money and the key to the officer's motorbike. Maxor Agbagba has more. The armed man on motorbike fired warning shots in a busy area on the N1 highway. They ordered the policeman and his friend to go down. They overpowered them and made a way with a bag containing the money. That is the account of an eyewitness who wants to remain anonymous. The policeman is our friend. I mean, mostly we are here with him. Do you get it? So he had come in, he had money on him. Do you get it? That he was going to pay a duty for a car. So one of our brothers should go with him and then he will be his witness. So when he came in, we were even, they were even having church service. I'm Muslim. So having church service in. So he called one of our elders here. When he came out with him, they were by the long cruiser. And then all of a sudden, a guy came with a gun. A shot, a pistol. And then he gave the warning shot that my friend, bring the money. So how, does, how did he know that they had money on him? Yeah. He had money on him. Do you get it? So when the warning shot came, then he had to lie down. And then he searched the policeman. He said, you know, he, he found out that there was no firearm on him. And he asked, where is his motorbike? Where is the key? And he asked, this is the key. So he took the key from him, and then he asked him to give him the money. This is the exact spot here on the N1 highway where the um, incident happened, very close to um, a car dealership. Behind me is a motorbike of the policeman. The robbers bolted with a key to that motorbike, so they are unable to move it now. The distraught policeman um, is unable to speak to us. He showed us the shell casing of the gunshot that was fired before the robbers collected the 80,000 CDs. The policeman agreed to speak to me when we talked via the phone, but said he couldn't any longer when we got to the scene. He confirmed the incident and told me how it happened. I've now met one of his friends who was at the car dealership when the robbery happened. He heard the warning shots and rushed out. Boy, I'm now on the make on all driving. I mean, me who you answer? Was he? I'm robbing some robbers. I'm robbing. That's a boy back who clear to the man who was stepping out with started shouting, armed robbers, armed robbers. I saw one of the robbers turning to see if anyone was watching. I saw the policeman on the ground with one of my uncles. He tried chasing them, but we couldn't apprehend them. He brought the money inside where I was. And I asked if it was money he was keeping in that manner. And in about two to three minutes, I heard the gunshots. Joy News cannot at the moment independently confirm if the matter has been reported to the police. Our checks at the Tesano police station revealed the matter was yet to be officially reported. A senior officer at the Great 